Good morning, guys. We're in France today. And by France, I mean Epcot France. Um, we're gonna get food if you say anything. Shh. I don't trust you. I don't know why I'm giving you this camera time. All right, you lost it. I took, can't talk. You took too long. I'm not allowed to talk. You, no, you weren't allowed to say anything about a vlog. Excuse me, excuse me, I need the camera. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Was I not following directions? I was following directions. Credit. Thank you. There was a reason that stipulation was put forth, Matt. <laughs> anyway, we're going to go get some food in France because it's open before the rest of uh, World Showcase in the mornings. Usually World Showcase doesn't open until 11, uh, but it is currently 9.08. But France opens so you can go get nice foods and pastries and stuff like that. Um, probably gonna get some of that bacon roll that we had last time. <laughs> so Abby got a beignet. How's it going with the beignet? I know, but like you seem, you seem to be struggling a bit. I'm fine. Alright. Um, I got bacon roll thing, Matt got a bacon roll thing, and a parfait. parfait. I forgot what it was called for a second. Um, so did Andrew, and they're splitting that, so. Gonna have some breakfast. So it's already immediately way hotter, or sweatier than it was yesterday. Uh, I'm not quite sure what we're actually gonna do right now, but um, we're just kinda walking around trying to find out, see if things have shorter weights, see if there's an opportunity for us to go do stuff, I don't know. Um, well, there's always stuff to do but I finally caught up back to the family. Spaceship Earth is 10 there. Spaceship Earth is 10 minutes. I think we're taking a picture. One sec. So a decision has been made. Spaceship Earth is what we're gonna do. Abby, what do you have to say about it? Epcot. Yeah, oh. yeah, that one. All right. I didn't know what you were talking about. <laughs> I was like, uh, it's a good Epcot. ride. Epcot foul. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're worried actually that Abby is just gonna ascend into it and assimilate into the Epcot ball. Um, who knows, we'll see if we have an Abby after this ride. So we have an Andrew, we have a Matt, an Abby. I thought I was Dana. Abby's right there. She did not get assimilated into the ball. <sighs> Slightly disappointing, but I guess we'll move on. We're off to Mission Space, which is different than Spaceship Earth on multiple levels, but I always used to get them mixed up all the time. Never could tell which one was which. But we're gonna go on green. Green is the less intense version. And now kind of not Mission Space, but Mission Outer Atmosphere. Because you don't really leave Earth. So for the uninitiated among you, Mission Space is essentially a space simulator um, that in the case of the mission that we're going on, we'll take you around the outer atmosphere and then back to Earth. There are two levels, there's green and there's orange. Green is like the less intense, uh, and orange is the more intense. Orange is the one where you really feel the G's and you know, you get the pressure and your face is just like, um, and that's the one I really like, but the green one is more appropriate for everyone. So, you know, let's, um, Let's just say the green one is a little bit more, uh, well, you know, like the name says, less intense. But it's a fun time. Um, you get, like, different jobs. You get an engineer, captain, not captain, pilot, uh, navigator, and commander. So, I already said engineer. Ah. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's, it's a fun time. It's a really fun ride, and I'd recommend it for anyone who's Who's into simulators, if you're not into closed spaces, don't go on it though, because the screen's like right here in your face. So, maybe not for you. Mm-hmm. That ride is just as basically satisfying as I remember. Nothing amazing and nothing terrible. Just the way I like my simulators. So, now we're gonna go to Mouse Gear, which is, again, for those of you who don't know, what are those giant, like, Disney stores? Oh, this one's in Epcot. Um, this one has a bunch of Halloween stuff, and we always get, like, a Halloween hat or a shirt or both um, for this Halloween 
celebration thing that we do um, one day starting last year and I'm talking about it as if it's like this big thing we do all the time um, but we're gonna pick some stuff out might show you some of the stuff I have for options and then eventually when we actually go there'll be a couple videos from now but you'll see what I pick out but that that's the selection so I've got a couple choices to make scoped out a little bit of the Halloween merch, so to speak. And then uh, we're off to Mexico, which is honestly probably the prettiest uh, pavilion in World Showcase. It's probably the best, in my opinion. I really think it's quite beautiful. I'll show you later, but the inside is like a night market. It's really pretty. So we went into Mexico and we came out of Mexico. When we went in, it was sunny and fine. And then when we came out, it's sunny and raining. And I mean, broad blue day, sun shower. It's great. I love it. What? Oh, there you are. Uh, so, uh, so we're gonna pop back to the hotel real quick. And then we're gonna head off to Animal Kingdom where we actually have fast passes. So we're gonna actually go do things we're like planned to do. So that will be interesting. Also, I like Animal Kingdom. It's a good vibe. So between then and now, it absolutely downpoured. Went back to the hotel room, and now we're in Animal Kingdom, or we're almost in Animal Kingdom. We just have to go through the gate and such. Um, it's still just as hot. It just rained for about 15 seconds. And we're off to Expedition Everest first. But I think that's not until 2.05. So we might just mess around and do what we want to do. Probably get some lunch, honestly, because we haven't eaten for a little while. So we got food and it's pulled pork mac and cheese. Look at that. Look how good. Look how delicious. Hi, Dana. So yeah. This is definitely something you should get if you come here and you eat beef, meat. This isn't beef, it's pulled pork. I just said it was pulled pork. I don't, I don't know guys. My brain, I think, is just leaking out of my ears more and more every day. We're parting ways and bye Andrew, Matt. They're back there somewhere. Um, they're going to Dinosaur because they don't like Everest. Uh, Andrew, not really a roller coaster person. And Matt hates heights, so that too. So we're gonna go chill out for a little while. We have some time. We have near on half hour before we actually have to be in line. So probably gonna go shopping a little bit, maybe. Maybe look at some stuff. Try not to get rained on. Huh? figure it out. You see that? That's Everest. Well, that's the roller coaster Everest. Obviously, it's not the real one, but uh, it's closed right now because we have some thunderstorms around, and I'm pretty sure that the uh, protocol is that if there's a storm with lightning strikes within like 25 to 30 miles or something like that, I might be wrong on the, on the distance, but um, they have to shut it down. So now we're waiting. Uh, we've got some time. Uh, now, so we're just kind of kill time. I got Dana a Yeti because every time we go into that store So for those of you who don't know who di know Disney and how they operate um, Every time you get off a ride you go through a gift shop Makes sense, right? But every time we go through this gift shop and you can get to it before going off or go on the ride But every time we go through this gift shop Dana likes she looks at this spherical Yeti thing Every year it's been about five years now and she's going to college uh, in, next month and uh, I figured it'll be a nice little thing that she can take with her reminder of her brother so she doesn't forget about me she'll be fine but I just you know I felt like buying it for her because she is 
She's special to me, you know? I love her a lot, so. Let's see if we can just kill time and hopefully we'll actually get on this mother. Oh well. I found anything overwhelmingly interesting. Oh, we saw Kevin from the movie Up. Apparently they have a, uh, they have a character Kevin now, which is pretty damn cool. Yeah. I'm enjoying this. Uh, it's really warm still, and uh, I need water, so let's, I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go find water. Well, that happened. Um, actually got an Everest, it was good. We only actually end up waiting about 20 minutes, um, and then they opened up again, we got in line, and got on the ride. Uh, it was just three of us, so ended up having a, a fourth, who we didn't know, but she was lovely, so it was very nice. Um, now we're off to look at tigers, hopefully, and not get rained on. But uh, we might, you never know, probably will. Actually, um, most likely we will. So, who knows? It might be another one of those Pandora moments we had from a couple years ago. Who knows? Now we get the real fun time to uh, try to dodge rain. Uh, we are gonna go look at the tigers. It's closed. Um, not quite sure why, but uh, it's now raining. It's starting to rain a lot more than it was. Um, and we're gonna go over Pandora. Let's hope nothing breaks. There it is. We're getting drinks. We've got dry land, and we're, um, you know. Just wait until our next thing. I think we're going on Navi River Ride next, so that'll be fun. Um, it's beautiful. That one's just pretty. That's one's fun to be on, so enjoy that. Uh, until then, I'll probably show you the drink I get, but other than that, I'm pretty done for now. Maybe later. So something that never occurred to me, um, we're actually at like a lounge kind of area. It's really, really quite nice. Um, I got me a drink. I got a Tempting Tigress. It's a bourbon-based cocktail. It's quite tasty. It's very good. Um, yeah, we're just, like I said, we're just hanging out here. Um, got a little food. Um, so, looking forward to it. Uh. Hey, hi! Okay, so we're doing this now. Um, so, long story short, Dana's not supposed to be walking a ton because something's up with her foot. Um, so I'm pushing her in a wheelchair. Why is it so wobbly? The upside of that, I guess, in this situation, is I kind of have a mobile tripod. You have human me. I I'm have, a tripod now. I have human Dana. So we're going on Navi River Ride? Yes. Yep. I'm trying. Um, so it's just kind of like a really relaxed kind of ride. And I'm trying to keep going. All right. I'll see you afterwards. So Dana, yeah. you might be in a, in a wheelchair, but what's that? Slice. Yeah. How, what what's in it though? I've never actually asked you. It's like the, I don't know. It's like mango and like other. It's like mango and pineapple. So they, like a tropical. It's a tropical slushy slushy kind of thing. And I think these are dragon fruit cola. Oh cool. Yeah. What's it called? All right. Well, if you like that kind of oh, flavors and stuff. Oh. I think it's a lotus something or other. Lotus something or other slush. Go for it. She yeah. likes it. So yeah, Dana likes the night lotus. Uh, boba, that thing. I prefer just green beer, just general green beer. It's called Hawks Grog Ale or something like that, and it's just it's just beer that's green, and I love it. It's just strange and good, and I recommend it. There's another one that is supposedly like a red ale. Um, it's also tasty, but it doesn't look as crazy as this. So. It is now 7.13. Abby's tired. Andrew's tired. I'm tired. They're tired. Dana's, Dana's tired. Uh, but we have one more fast pass for Kilimanjaro Safari at 7.15. It's currently 7.12. Um, so we're just kind of chilling out here. What's this place called? This little stand? Matt? What? The Harambe fruit stand or something like that. Uh, 
It's a, it's been a hot one, hasn't it? Yeah. So funny story. Just recorded a 24 lo minute long video in my pocket. Can't hear anything, but my phone was on for 24 minutes recording. That did wonders for my battery. I bet. Great. Now we're grabbing a minivan. Um, that's not a minivan. That's a minivan. Uh, and we're gonna head back to the hotel. We're gonna grab flatbread pizzas. We're gonna grab some sort of other thing, maybe a drink, maybe a dessert, who knows. We're gonna chill out, we're gonna call it a night there. I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for riding the Tilt-A-Whirl. Good night. I love Disney. <laughs>